Hello YouTube community. Once again, <laughs> it is that time again everyone for our box packing video. Um, we have a lovely little baby here. Say hello. Hi. <laughs> She's adorable. And I had a lot of fun making her. She was a joy to make. Um, I just fell in love with her. She reminded me of um, a sleeping angel. Because the way that her mouth looks, I've seen that look before on babies' faces. and It's kind of a half smile when they're sleeping. And I just always say it, it makes me think they're playing with angels when I see that look. And so she's just a precious little angel. Here she is, close up. Say hi, Mommy. Say I love you. I'm coming home. So she's three months old. Absolutely gorgeous. She has blonde hair. And I rooted it, you know, you guys know me and, and really thick haired babies, but I actually rooted her hair um, thinner because I wanted it just to have just a different look. And it just really turned out nice. She has all the blushing. She has beautiful blonde eyelashes, veins, uh, capillaries. She even has a small cut that her mommy will see. Stick pessy. You can't see it here, but there's a small cut right here on her chin that she has as well so she is just absolutely the bat and you can't see her blonde eyelashes because she's probably getting a little washed out here but she's just a sleeping puggy nose a sleeping angel um so um her mommy is definitely gonna get her and she is so excited oh let's find your mouth there we go let's get it in there She's so excited about having her baby come home. So, as usual, I like to... We're going to take her headband off. She's got a little bed head. I always like to show what goes with the babies for the most part. And what the babies go through in order to be prepared to go home to their mommies. So, typically what I like to do is just give them a little light spritz. Just to be sure that she's just so cute with her little Pessy. That they've got enough um, to cover them. And her hair had started to get a little dry. And her, her mommy has had reborn babies before. So she'll know how important it is to make sure that her hair is taken care of. And it's cute because her hair actually gets a little bit longer in the back um, and everything and I just kind of smooth it smooth it down and once it's wet it'll lay a lot better too her hair has a lot of short stubby pieces into it which I thought just gave it more realism because um, hair isn't always the same length exactly all over so what this is doing is just blending it all into one long line and that's how mommy will get the best results out of her hair let's just brush it into one long line and then let's see there we go and her hair actually it's I'm saying blonde but it's a mixture of different colors She's got, she has blonde, almost a ash blonde, blonde, ash blonde, and even a light brown I kind of did just to give her some different colors, but it just blends so nicely. And that's it. And her hair is sparsely rooted. She's one of the babies that I did not root hard, so she does have... Um, very thin thinly rooted hair but that's what I love about her because it just gives her more um, I felt more real as him hey hello so um, so basically she um, ha her head does turn let me just show you here and it turns this way as well <laughs> look at that little face so she has a turning head. 
Um, she, let's see here. Take this pussy out. There we go. Let's lay her down so we can hopefully. I got so much stuff on the bed because I need to show you what all mommy will get with her. So let's just see here. So she's laying down now, but she has pierced ears, and um, let's see, I'm going to keep everything separate. There you go. So what I have her in now, she's in a onesie that she'll come home with with her mom, and it's a really cute onesie. It's adorable, and I think you may have saw it on another video, but the onesie says, I love you across the top and it has like a little heart in the middle see it's a heart in the middle she says I love you and she has pierced ears and of course this is washing out some of her blushing and everything here the lighting is very terrible <laughs> but she has more color than what she looks here she's definitely um, light, uh, you know, a, a lighter complexion, but she is has more of the pink hues and blushing than it's showing here. And then this is just a snap on here, and so these are really two things. This is just a onesie, and then I just put a sleeper on top. And the sleeper is adorable; it has a cute little smiling ladybug on it. Look at that, and she's just adorable. She's five about five and a half pounds she is 23 inches so she is three months old um, so she's a bigger baby but still a baby not a toddler not yet see I'm not ready to start walking yet I'm still little and uh, it's her little arms here that's so cute and again this is just washing out the color <laughs> of her Look at her little legs. Let's see how chunky I am. And, um, but she's just adorable. Adorable. So, uh, okay. So what I'm going to say, I'm going to let, she's going to come home in this outfit she's in now. I'm going to go ahead and snap it back up. And it's got cute pink bows on the outside of it, which is just absolutely adorable. And just snap all the way up on you, sweetie. Okay. I feel like I missed some snaps down here. <laughs> Maybe your mommy will be better at snapping up these than I will. There we go. Had you all bungled up. Okay. That's, there's a snap that just doesn't want to cooperate with me. There we go. <laughs> okay. So, she's nice and snug as a bug in a rug is my my little one says to me all the time and there we go all right so she's all snuggly and um let's see if we can get her <laughs> oh there she goes and i'm gonna put this back on her mom this will come with her and this is just you know what So we'll just keep it pink. We'll use this one. All right. So she really works the headbands well because she has um, thinly rooted hair, and the headband actually gives her extra oomph. <laughs> and then I just brush her little baby hairs, um, her little wisp of hair, to the side here of it. But she, her, she's just gorgeous. She's just absolutely gorgeous. She has her little wispy, wispiness. And the ends, it's up to the mom. I mean, some people would say, well, I'm going to take this off. There's, there's extra hair here. And you can and make it shorter. 
but I actually left it that way if the mommy wants to make it shorter she can or she can keep it with the length that's all fine see that's fine mommy but she is adorable look how it scoots you back and there she goes so she is a heavy baby um and she's a, a tall baby there you go at 23 inches so let's just kind of let this blanky all right so she's she's ready for that now let's get into um some items that i'm just having a little difficulty day in maneuvering here some items that will be going with her see some items that'll be going with me mommy and uh stuff like that she looks just extra cute with her pissy All right, so extra things that'll be going with her. All right, so you know she's she's gonna come with this. She'll come with the headband, um, and her onesie and the sleeper. It's really cute and snuggly. All right, so mommy, she comes with this is princess, and it has like a little kitty cat on it. Can you see it? it says princess. Okay, we're gonna put that in the box. It's gonna go with her and keep her hair just absolutely adorable is her little Dora. He's this Dora the Explorer. Come set, Russian come set. So we're gonna put that in the box, mommy. Okay. Um the other things that will be coming, I oh here we are. Where we go? Okay. I don't um, really worry so much with the newborn size diapers for her because she's more of a three month old. So um, these are size two and I think these should fit as I put on her first diaper and I believe I used a size two. <laughs> so hopefully I'm not wrong about that. And they have little bears. I don't know if you can see that on them. Three diapers. So those will go there. And one I'll probably have on her head to protect her. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, and you've had a reborn before. Her mommy's not a, not new to reborns, so she will know the importance of having um, the conditioner. She probably has her own spray bottle. So I'm gonna put some into this mommy for you to to use if you if you need some or we're running out. Um, to kind of get you started, so I'll put some in here. Now she. Let me see here. I generally sent all my babies. I would be shocked if she isn't sent it on the inside. However, um, as I mentioned in a previous video, sometimes it takes a while longer for some of the the smell to kick in than others, and sometimes it just doesn't seem to take sometimes. So um, she will come with her powders. There we are. And so um, the powders, again, like I mentioned in my other video, you can just sprinkle just a little bit in a diaper if you just want to add that little fresh scent. Um, but it's not necessary, but some mothers do like to, reborn mothers do like to use it. Okay. Uh, let's see here. What else? Oh. <clears throat> there is their Pessy. Okay, here we go. So she won't come with this Pessy. I've actually gotten her a cuter Pessy actually these are so cute it says my girl and you may have saw it in one of my hauls and I hinted in the haul that this may be a couple of items in here for the new mommy well this is one of them um, so it says my girl and actually it's so adorable I have to go back and get some for my babies um, but it will be her her Pessy um, holder and then she has a new Pessy here that mommy can modify she just needs to have the magnet and so she'll come with this set here okay <clears throat> all right you guys know i'm, I'm ridiculous about bibs <laughs> i think another one of my videos i said i babies with bibs on with jackets okay um 
All right. So I, you know, I love babes. Um, this says cutie patootie. It's got the little pink and she's got the little Velcro little flap. So it'll be going with her. Okay. And this is her receiving blanket and it's pink. And it has little princess crowns. I don't know if you can see all in it. Little hints of green and then princess, pink princess crowns. Uh, it was really cute. She is such a cute little princess. So, put that in there. Okay. Um, she comes with a belly plate. So, I'm just going to cover for my PG, PG. I hope I say that, show that. My PG. Uh, people so it is a belly plate she'll be coming with and um, it's a full belly plate so I'm covering the bottom um, so it's a full front is is on here as well uh, so she'll be coming with this and um, and I was telling the mother that when I did the belly plate the only way that it works for pictures or photographs is you have to have it way down, which means that this does not match here. <laughs> she ended up being a lot bigger than what I thought she was going to be when she was completed. So it doesn't match, but to take pictures, you'll get the belly shot and what's beneath the belly and it'll be great for pictures. But, um, other than that, it, it's, you know, so that's pretty much that, but I told her about it and she, I gave her the option of if she didn't want it, that was fine. If she did, I would send it. So that takes care of that. Um, okay. Keep calm and carry on. This is a zero to three months. She is a big girl. So it's a queen crown. Keep, keep calm and carry on the princess crown. It's really cute. So she's got that and she has her new little pants and they're just a little pair of pink pants that can go with that top. So it has the little tack thing holding the pant leg up so this will go with her as well um, oh we're moving into cooler weather where I am even here in the south and this is great it has castles and make a wish and princessy type things and castles so I think everyone has figured out her theme is going towards the princess theme <laughs> okay and then this I love. This is just a little nice warm hat. It has little rocking horses on it. And baby carriages etched in it. Which you can't really see because again the washout. But she'll be, she'll come with this as well. I don't want to put it on her head right now because, well, hmm. I was going to say I didn't want to mess up her hair. But I'm almost, nah. nah. I won't do it because that way her head won't be so bad when. Her hair won't be so bad when her mommy pulls her out of the box. It'll probably be bad enough when she gets out of the box. So, do to make it worse. Okay, so we'll put that in for you, mommy. And um, I'm going to have my, my five-year-old make more of these. So, I'm getting kind of low. This says love. Except for my five-year-old didn't quite put the box in the right order. But it's supposed to say love. <laughs> Let's just go with that. But um, she's going to have... Her bracelet there you go see where would I be without my Aiden's angel nursery bracelet made by an angel and on an angel so she's wearing her bracelet mommy it was made with love even though the letters may not be in the right place by my beautiful angel um, she just turned six so we celebrated her birthday she's a sweetheart but she believes in sending all my angels with a little bit of love. So she makes these little bracelets and she wants to be really helpful and send them off um, with love. So of course they're made with love in my home and love very dearly before they go to their new homes and are also loved and, and cherished and, um, and everything. Okay, we're almost done mommy. It's been a long video. <laughs> she will also come with these. I thought these were just adorable. They're the cutest little booties. And they're like socks slash booty-ish, you know. So it's kind of like a mixture of a sock and a booty together. But they're just adorable. And they should fit her. 
Um, they go up to six months, so I figured I'd be safe with buying them. Okay, now, I generally like to send the babies with something to travel with. And guess who's going to be her travel partner this time? Hi! Hi, YouTube community! And he's so soft and so adorable. I mean, look at him. Isn't that just cute? Look at the little pot belly. <laughs> I thought he was the cutest thing, and he's so soft and just adorable. So he's going to travel with her. There you go. He's going to travel with her and uh, keep her nice and safe and everything. So, um, so yeah, so that pretty much concludes it. There will be, as usual, I put a, a, I may have a couple extra things to add in there um, and things of that nature. I've been in the middle of a transition, so um, it's hard to find where all of my stuff is as I rearrange everything and everything of that nature. Um, but, um, I probably will be adding just a couple more, more items as I <laughs> go through my boxes and find more things as I unpack. But, um, but yeah, well, thank you guys again for joining us and helping to send her off on a, a great box packing and to her new mommy. Um, I hope you love her, love her, love her and cherish her as much as I've grown to love her here. And my family's grown to love her as well. Um, she's just a sweet little angel. And, um, you know, again, she's made with a lot of love. And uh, she may not be perfect. Say, I have my imperfections, Mommy. But I think that's what, what makes babies and reborns so cute is that they're by their very imperfection, that just makes them more lovable as far as I'm concerned. So I appreciate you... Um, Wanting her to join your family. She's going to love it with you. From what I can see on, on your videos. <laughs> and how you take care of your, your little babies and dolls. So, um, alright. So with that, um, I don't know what you're going to name her. But um, definitely let me know what you come up with. Uh, and everything. But she's just adorable. Look at her. But, okay. Well, thank you all for joining us for her box packing. Wish her luck. Wish her mommy well and great tidings and we'll see you later say bye mommy say i love you can't wait to see you and spend time with you <laughs> all right take care <laughs> bye